Hey there, Ben Lipper here. The brand new Vex IQ game just came out, and we are jumping back into things nice and strong this season. So when it came out, I initially wanted to build a robot, like, right away. I didn't have any pieces. Um, we don't have, like, the discs are a little unique this year, so um, I had a bit of a challenge trying to recreate those. So I ended up waiting until I got the new game set. As soon as it showed up in the mail, though, we ripped it open, built the field, and built a robot, like, all in that day. Stay up till like, midnight practicing and trying to get it to work. Um, but I think we finally got it. Go ahead and check it out. Now, if you're looking at this robot, you're thinking, hey, that looks pretty good. I might be interested in building something like this. There's a link here in this video. Go ahead and click it. Um, we'll send you a whole bunch of details on kind of how the robot's built, what it looks like, all that good stuff. The idea is just if you want some inspiration, kind of want to see what other people are doing, go ahead and click that link. Uh, I'll send you some details. One thing this robot does really well is the easy stuff. Um, really quickly, we discovered that getting the discs out of that purple dispenser, the two big purple ones on the side, and getting the discs really anywhere beyond the two-point zone is really challenging this year. So the things this robot focuses on is just getting the discs out of the blue and yellow dispensers and then pushing them into that two-point zone, the one right on the other side of the bar that is super easy to get them into. Additionally, at the end, it's able to touch that zone because all the discs are in the same exact zone. We can just touch it and we can, like, increase our points significantly. So... Like I said before, if you're interested in building this robot, go to the link under this video. I'll be happy to send you kind of details on how it's built, what it looks like. Other than that, though, thank you so much for watching. As always, like and subscribe, and I look forward to seeing what you build.